can, can you speak a little bit about how the hospitality industry has embraced technology? Yeah, absolutely. I think, I think hospitality has actually embraced technology more or, or quicker than real estate side, if I can just throw that yeah. out there. Yeah. Um, yeah, so what we solved in that space is we were the first to bridge a software gap between traditional hospitality and their software systems. And traditional, I mean, hotels and condo hotels. Yeah. And new to them, marketplaces like Airbnb and Verbo. Okay. That's, that was our role. So in order to do that, we had to not only bridge software, but we had to provide hospitality because we're the ones responding to all the inquiries on VRBO and Airbnb and so on. So we're kind of this outsource hospitality tech, tech solution for these large, large companies. Like most people listening to this will know IHG, Intercontinental Hotel Group. We work with 600 of their hotels. So it's that kind of scale of hotel company. Um, and yeah, they were, I'd say even in, within hospitality, I think in some ways the hotel industry was early to adopt some technology back in the 90s and so on. But a lot of their tech today is a bit legacy and archaic. And the more modern tech you'll find in hospitality is now is the more modern property managers who have distributed assets. Uh, because you need to have better tech when you have 100 homes in Nashville, Tennessee, with different addresses and different linen packages than when you do when you have one building with 100 units served by one elevator where you're cleaning people can just walk around with a cart and serve all of that, right? So that's where we have the more progressive. Uh, and then by chance, and we can talk this a bit more, but we essentially landed offering something on the real estate side where we're bringing our hospitality tech experience and now putting it into the hands of real estate people. Yeah, I think that'd be fascinating to hear a little bit mm -hmm. more, more about that. Um, I think one of the things, and, and I think this goes along with it, that makes your product so much um, of a game changer is how you incorporate smaller shops into the business. Yes. I think that's what you're talking about. And if you could elaborate on that, I think that'd be phenomenal. Yeah. So I, I just love stories or Genesis stories. Cause to me, they always paint the picture. Well, how did you end up doing this? And what do you, about 18 months ago, we had a, a broker, a single broker owner on Cape Cod. She found our website and our website never talked about working with broker, <laughs> but she said, you know, I'm a buyer's agent mainly. When I sell a home, a lot of the buyers, they like me and they say, could you do my vacation rental management? Because these are oftentimes secondary investment properties on Cape Cod. And she says, and I don't, I don't want to, this is not my core competency. I'm not a vacation rental management company. Could you help me? And around her, you know, 18 months later, here we are. Now we have many more um, and signing up brokerages now, not just realtors. Um, but essentially, yeah, we built a, a technology and service solution, which is essentially not too different than what we were doing on the hotel side. But when you apply it first to a new market, you get to kind of develop the product around where essentially our tagline is we're a business in a box solution that empowers brokers and realtors to market, manage, and monetize their short-term listings. That's the elevator pitch right there. And we're yeah. truly a business in a box. And we can take any brokerage. Usually it's brokerages and leisure destinations that really resonate with this because they can see how much money the property managers around them are, are making. But a lot of them don't have the technology in-house or even the, the, the desire, frankly, to do a lot of this. And Jetstream comes in with a package solution. And we say, you're now a property manager, but we're going to do 95% of the work in the background. And we do it under your brand, which is what they love. Yeah. A change of pace from the Get Rich Quick gurus. Subscribe to the Real Finds podcast for in-depth conversations with voices shaping the real estate world.